Hi guys, welcome to RPA Stuff. In today's video we are going to learn few actions from PDF Automation Package of Automation Anywhere A360. We are going to learn following actions. Get property, extract text, extract image, and extract field. Let's go to Automation Anywhere and drag and drop get property action from PDF package. I will be using following PDF for demo. We can check properties of PDF file in Adobe Reader. Automation Anywhere extracts four properties of PDF file. PDF title, PDF author, PDF subject and PDF file name. For demo purpose I have kept PDF subject blank for this file. We will go back to Automation Anywhere and specify PDF path in respective section. If your file is password protected you can click on yes and add username password to access it. To store all properties we need a dictionary type variable, I have named it as PDF properties. Now let us use a loop action to iterate through each key present in the dictionary variable. Add PDF properties variable as source dictionary variable and assign iterated key value to a string variable. Use a message box to print both key and value of dictionary variable at each iteration. Let's run the bot to see output. As you can see bot has correctly extracted all file properties. If a property is blank the key will have null value. Now let us move to our next action, extract text. I will be using same PDF file for this demo. Add the PDF path and specify username, password if the file is password protected. We will first look at plain text type. You can add page numbers or range of page numbers if it is required to only get data from specific pages. I will select all since I have one page. Extracted text is stored in a text file. Specify a text file path and export data to text file section. You can get properties of PDF file using the same command to without using get property action separately. Let us save and run the bot. Our bot ran successfully and has extracted data correctly in the specified text file. Now let us see what is the difference between plain text and structured text. Change the text type and create new text file to store the result. Save and run the bot. If we see the result, structured text tries to retain format and alignment of the PDF file whereas in plain text data is extracted without any alignment as single paragraph. For our next demo we will try to extract text from a PDF file which is a scan invoice document. It is basically an image converted to PDF format. I will make changes to the extract text action we used in previous examples. Change the PDF path and add new output text file to see results. Let's run the bot to see output. As you can see the output file is blank. 
Extract Text Action cannot work on scanned PDF files. It is recommended to use OCR actions for such files. You can find card for my OCR package video by clicking on I button above. Now let us look at Extract Image Action. This action converts PDF document in image format. Drag and drop the action. Add PDF path in respective section. Select pages you want to convert into image. Automation Anywhere allows user to save PDF file in various image formats. I am selecting JPEG format. Add folder path to store the image file. In file prefix add prefix you want to add while saving image file. You can select the output image to be colored or grayscaled. It also allows to store PDF properties in dictionary variable. Let us save and run the bot. Our bot ran successfully and has converted PDF file into image file. Before we move ahead, if you are finding this video useful and informative, please like and share this video. Hit the subscribe button for more such videos. Let us move to next action extract field. Drag and drop the command and add the PDF file path. Click on Open PDF Viewer and Browse and select the PDF for preview. As shown on the screen, click on small square icon to draw region. I will try to capture invoice number from this document. Give it appropriate key name to store value. As you can see this command uses coordinates to locate values, it's highly unreliable. My selected region has extracted partial value. Let us retry by deleting our selection and again selecting same area with wider selection than before. Repeat the same steps if you want to extract more values and assign each to the new keys. Close the PDF viewer window once you are done and create a dictionary type variable to store all keys from all selection. I will add a message box to print the extract result. Let's run the bot to see output. Our bot ran successfully and has extracted data correctly. Extract field action can be only used when the format, alignment and resolution is same for all PDF files. It's recommended to use extract text action and then read the text file in a string variable. By using various string operations we can get much accurate results. Thank you for watching the video. Please like and share this video. Hit the subscribe button.